I guess in this video, I am going to discuss what entire function in MySQL database. So about the entire function, so it splits the rows into pre-specified number of groups. And the first group number start with 1 and the second with 2 and the third with 3. Like that continue. So add here, I am using table as EMT is my table and here I have given order by on dpt number. So this the records inside EMP table and here total numbers of rows are 14. So if you count here, so total numbers of rows are 14. And in my last video I discussed about the uh, row number rank, dance rank function. So please go through that one also. So let's copy that code to save some time. And here, so and here I need to entire function. So this two not required. And here, and here let's give meaningful name. Entire, and here of two partition by I will discuss later. Now here after in place of row number let's write entire function and time. Now if you execute this query, so at here three sorry four rows selected and here one rows for entire function. So in place of this all here I have uh, given the name entire. Now let's execute this query. So at here I'm getting the error message. The reason of error matches entire function must have one uh, argument. So let's give at here the argument to you. Now if you execute this query, so it's giving some values. So at here, this is the value it's uh, giving. So if you give at here entire two, so that means that create two, two group. So at here total numbers of rows are at here of uh, 14. So that create two groups. First is for one and second for two. So this is the first group here. So this is the first group. If you count, so at here one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And now so next that create group here. So this also create two groups. So this totals are seven. Now if you give at here 3, so that create 3 group. So for that is start from 1, so at here 3 group, so at here the value is now 1. So 1 is 5 times and here after 2 is 5 times, so 5 plus 5 10 and here 3 is 4 times. So this take this create 3 group. So if you give at here 4. So that create four groups. So that is start from one. So see at here that is start from one. So at here, or uh, this is a four now. So four group creates and here fourteen. So four fourteen by four. So that divide by three times. And here the remainder return two. So at here see, uh, one is four times and here two is also four times and here three is also four times. So for three is sorry three is three times and here four plus four eight eight plus three eleven eleven plus at here this is four is three times so eleven plus three totals are now fourteen so at here if you give five so that create to five groups let's execute here so see at here it's a creating group so at here of oh, five so this is the first here one Three times and here two three times and here three it's a three times and here four it's a three times and next five so three into four twelve twelve a plus or five is two times twelve plus two this is a fourteen so whatever you give the value according to given the value that create the groups and here. The grouping value is start from 1. So this is the 1. So if you give at here 14, so total numbers of rows are 14. 
okay so if you execute this query so that uh, create 14 group so 14 by 14 here yeah. so 14 uh, group so 14 by 14 so add here this group 1 so add here for every group the value is 1 so unique value not a duplicate so add here this is 1 group here 2 3 4 so number is start from 1 so this is second group here yeah. this is third group for third row fourth group for fourth row so this is the uses of entire function to create the group according to given parameter so at your entire function you should use over by class so it's a essential and about the over by class i already discussed in my previous videos and here in entire function partition by class is the optional part so if you want then you can give so if you give at your partition by so i am doing the partition on dpt number so that separate dpt number so at here dpt i am getting the error message okay partition by or uh, dpt number as okay let's give at here two so in emp number here of two over okay one bracket is there so that here i am getting the error now let's execute here so about the partition by so partition by is used to break the data so i i did the partition by on dpt number so 10 that break into one part so that here that's create the group 2 so i have given the two values so that create 2 and here this is for So at here this is of 20 so that 20 is the 6 times so 6 by 2 so that to uh, create to add your 2 groups and the value 3 3 times so 3 for 1 3 for 2 and here 13 is the same 13 is the 6 times so here 13 by 6 by 2 so it's so uh, here it's also 6 times 6 by 2 is the 3 so at here or uh, it's get the 2 groups for 1 and 2 so like this if you give at your 3 so at here i'm getting 10 is only two times so that here it's creating 1 2 now at here the 20 is the 6 times so 6 times 20 see if you can't here it's a 6 times 6 times total so 6 uh, 6 by 3 2 okay so uh, total group that create 3 and here the possible combination 1 2 times 2 2 times 3 3 times so this is the things about entire function is to use to create the group according to given or uh, condition like partition by on dpt number and creating order by sap so this is the things and here ab about the row number so it's a give you a distinct so you cancel number and here about to rank function so this will give you rank on or cell columns but here it's a duplicate here this is so or duplicate as here as well as add here it's a leave some gap between the numbers dance rank it's a sequential but it's give you duplicate value when that font is any duplicate so like this entire function is used to create the uh create to uh, numbers and uh, ranking numbers but the ranking numbers that create whatever the parameter value that you give so if you give add here 3 so that means that create 3 groups so 3 groups add here so add here partition by so 3 or uh, 10 is a partition on one part 20 is the one part 30 is the one part and here i applied entire function on cell column so add here or uh, since uh, add here cell column is a dsc so add here the highest cell it's the displaying first here this is the dpt 20 so the highest cell is 13 and here this is 2850 so by this you can also find highest salary according to department wise so you have to use pair clause and filter entire equal to 1 so that's that will give you highest salary uh, in department wise so this is the things about entire function so entire function is split the rows into pair specified group number of group and the value start from 1 and like 
Let's start from more and then continue. So I hope guys this video is helpful for you. So now in this video it's over. So thanks for watching. See you next video. Thank you.